For this DIY, you're going to need two wire baskets from Dollar Tree, the waste cans. Uh, they come in both white and black. I have only been able to, my local Dollar Trees, um, find white. And what we are going to do is use E6000 to attach one on top of the other. E6000. So I am going to actually measure because sometimes um, one basket is at least a little bit bigger than the other on the bottom. And if you come across two like that, I would suggest using the can with the um, bigger bottom on the bottom and then attaching the little bit smaller one on top like so. Like this fits absolutely positively perfect and that's going to look super super nice all right so what I'm doing I am using a generous amount of E6000 Well, the baskets are done drying, um, however, I noticed a little bit of a gap right here, and that's just because of the bottoms of the baskets being a little bit uneven. I was going to finish attaching, I mean it's not coming apart, but I don't like how that looks, so I'm going to give it a good go around with hot glue and fill that in let that dry and then on to the next step now I'm going to fill in the gaps right here with a good amount of hot glue and let that dry I'm going to work my way all the way around and this is going to be trimmed anyway so you won't even be able to see the glue when it's done from Dollar Tree you will need a roll of lace ribbon and I'm going to hot glue the ribbon around where I um, I started uh, well where I joined these two waste cans together and uh, did an extra roll of glue to actually um, fill it in a little so I am going to start gluing the ribbon on like so and be careful can't stress enough when you're dealing with hot glue I have burned myself once really really bad and uh, it don't tickle so you just want to get it all the way around cover up that glue seam so you can't see where the two cans are joined work real quick and just quickly lightly 
Tarzan. This is an old pizza pan that I'm going to be using for the top of the table. And I'm going to finish up the last of my lilac uh, spray paint. I thought that this would look pretty with a lilac shade on it with seashells. would definitely look super cute. So, going to let that dry. Probably finish it off with two coats. Now I am going to glue on some seashells. I have a bag of seashells from Dollar Tree. Um, mostly they are uh, a few large ones like this. And more of these ones, the scallop ones. And they are the ones that I'm going to actually glue on here. I'm going to be using adhesive, the Fix-All adhesive, to be sure that these stay on. Now you can pretty much attach the seashells whatever way you feel like attaching them. There's, there's no pattern you need to do. Um, Basically, you can just randomly, randomly attach them, however, however you want to put them. Guys, I was having no luck attaching the seashells with Fix-All Adhesive. They were not holding in place uh, sturdily. So I scrapped that idea and I used hot glue instead. Uh, hot glue working out so much better. So I do apologize, but trial and error here, you know. I applied a quick coat of polyurethane to prevent chipping on the top surface of the pizza pan. And now I'm going to attach the pan to the table. My way around the top of the waste can. I'm not worried about hot glue falling in because it dries quick and I can peel off the string. So that's one good thing about hot glue. Okay. And I'm going to center this like so. holding it down for a minute or two and then I'm going to go around the whole outside with some more hot glue and this is going to dry for a while. I'm going to give it at least a good hour or two.
Well, guys, as a finishing touch, I uh, I happen to have another set of LED candles, and I just simply took a piece of the lace ribbon and attached three small little uh, seashells with some hot glue. Um, these shells are mine. I have had them for a little while, and I just thought it would look pretty on here. Um, the thought did occur to me yesterday that maybe gluing some seashells inside here on the bottom of this can would have also looked really pretty, or uh, gluing some of the um, the flat beads that are in the floral section at Dollar Tree would also look pretty. But that thought occurred to me, as I said, after I attached the top. But if anybody does try that, send me a pic and let me know because oh, that's a good idea for another project and another time. Well, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all soon. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.